Thanks, everybody. Great to be here. First, I want to thank Carlisle Events um, for having us here and uh, allowing us to be part of the All Chrysler Nationals. Can't think of a better opportunity, a better place in the entire world than the Collector Car Appreciation Day at the All Chrysler Nationals to unveil a couple of cars that I think you're going to be very interested in. So without further ado, before I start talking about them, let's get the covers off these things and show you what's under the covers. We can just roll up the covers here. We can We have two pretty unique cars up here, and to start this off, what I want to do is uh, introduce Eric Andrew of the Dodge brand and Challenger to just tell a little bit about kind of how this came to pass um, and how we got connected to uh, talk about these cars. So I'm going to introduce Eric, and then I'll tell you in detail about the cars. Thanks, Mark. Mark and uh, Pat, another guy in his organization, came to me. I'm the Dodge brand uh, manager for the Challenger, so. I'm lucky enough to work on the Challenger on a daily basis. And he came to me and said, hey, look, Pat and I have got a great 71 Challenger, club crazy, 426, I won't give away all the, the details. We want to make this a really outstanding uh, giveaway program. Would you join forces with us? And I said, you know what? That would be awesome. Club crazy is one of my favorite colors. You talked about uh, the, the um, uh, uh, charities that they were going to support, and I know this is a really good thing that Dodge should get involved with. So, I won't say too much more about the cars, but just to recognize that this is a truly outstanding opportunity for Dodge to join forces with the dream car giveaway folks and do something really special. Thanks, Eric. Appreciate it very much. So, you're looking at two cars up here. That the first one you're going to recognize immediately it's a 1971. 426 Hemi Challenger, of course, it's a pistol grip four speed, one of 70 cars built that year. There were 426 cars. It's a radio delete car, which is one of eight cars. You guys know these facts a whole lot better than me, but I can tell you it's a pretty rare car. Not only is it a rare car, but it's a beautiful example of one. It was in Randy Lerner's collection. He was the owner of the Cleveland Browns, and we had the opportunity to acquire it for this initiative. He loved the idea that the car would uh, be promoted and, and help charities along the way. Um, and you guys, I'm sure, have seen some of our giveaways. We always try and pair a classic with kind of a fast-forward version of, of what that would be today. So when we talked to Eric and we went to Chrysler, we said, can you imagine what this car would be today? So what you're looking at is a brand new Challenger, obviously. But with the help of Mopar Performance Parts, Chrysler Design, Arrington Performance, they're going to tell you a little bit about what was done to this car to make it a 700 horsepower ground-pounding piece that is, as Bill said, collector cars don't have to be old cars. This car is a one-on-one car. It's signed by some of the folks at Chrysler and, and, and Arrington Performance, and it is an instant collectible. So, as you guys know, whether you have a new one or an old one, to you it's a collectible, and it will always be. This is a very, very valuable, irreplaceable pair of cars, and someone's going to win them. They're going to win them for a three dollar entry which benefits charity it's a tax deductible donation and you go to enter by to go to winthemopars.com it'll be online it'll run through may 31st next year and after the conclusion one winner will be selected to get both cars along with fifty thousand dollars which will pay the taxes so that you can keep them as a pair we don't want you to split them up so i want to just for a minute introduce um, a couple of people we have some folks from Mopar who want to tell you about what uh, was done to the car, and Eric Kurz also from Arrington Performance. Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Rick Perez. I'm a product plant manager at Mopar Accessories and Performance Parts back in Detroit. And when we got, by the way, who loves Mopars? Yeah, that's, that's what we're all about. Right on. Mopar or no car? So anyways, we got the call from our brothers over at Dodge. Eric gave us a call and said, hey, we're working with the Dream Car Giveaway folks, and we wanted, we got this real special project. Do you guys want to participate? So we sat down and talked about it. We said, what a great opportunity to partner with the Dodge folks and come up with some great parts. So we provided uh, the team a uh, coilover suspension kit, uh, exhaust kit, pistol grip shifter. So this had a little bit of one more performance touches to it. So, Really, but the, the heart of the matter is what the folks at Arrington have done. So I'd like to turn over to Eric from Arrington and let him tell you all about the real heart of this program. So 
So let's say that again. One person is going to win both these cars and $50,000 to pay the taxes. Come on. So we're very, very proud to be part of this project. It, it's worth thanking Bo Park and Dodge one more time for providing us with the canvas that we get to work on every day. In this case, we're working on a 6-4 based 426. It's got a 4050 stroke, the 4090 bore, and it's supercharged courtesy of Edelbrock. Car makes around 700 horsepower with just at 7 pounds of boost. Don't know what the quarter mile time is. We don't know how much actual power it can make to the wheel, but the first person that gets it is welcome to bring it back down to Harrington. We'll put it on the dyno in front of them with a the camera with their new car, and we'll see how it performs. Once again, I want to thank the Dream Car Giveaways, especially Dodge Challenger and Mopar Performance for giving us this opportunity to make something special for one person.